PhotoView 60 uh, photorealistic rendering is really neat. You can get some really amazing images. But what if you wanted to do something like this, where you have just your model and you want to bring it into a photo processing program such as you know, Paint.net like I have here or Photoshop? How can you get a nice transparent image like this and not have any of that background information show up? Well, I'm going to show you how you can do this. Now, this depends on whether you're using SOLIDWORKS 2012 or 2013. First, I'll show you 2012. Now, I want to go in under the Display Manager and the Appearance and Scenes tab, and I just want to go in here and completely remove the background. So I'll just select None, and notice these reflections and shadows. I just want to turn those off. Now, what's going to happen here is when I go in to do my render, this is actually going to give me a completely blank background. Now, when it comes to the render window, the final output, I have the ability to save out this rendered file, and I have a number of different file options available to me. Now, if I were to save this image as, for instance, a JPEG, it would actually give me a white background. But in this case, I don't want to use a JPEG, I want to use a PNG format. Now, the PNG file format, it actually supports transparency. So the background is just going to be taken right out of there. It's going to have it as a transparent layer, and now it's going to be able to be brought into something like Photoshop and have a nice transparent background. Now, in SOLIDWORKS 2013, this functionality has changed a little bit more. Notice here, I'm starting out with uh, just a regular render. In fact, I even have a photograph in the back here. But what matters is what file format I choose. So I don't have to delete the background. In fact, I can use the same exact render window, and I just need to pick from two different file types. So either a file type that supports uh, transparency or one that doesn't. So I'm going to save out a PNG and a JPEG of this exact same render, and we're going to look at what the difference is. So once I select uh, J, or a PNG here, I can just save this file out. And now you can see no background. But the JPEG file, it does show my background. So exact same render window, two different outputs, depending on whether I'm choosing a file format that supports transparency, like PNG or a TIFF file, or if I select something that doesn't support transparency, like a bitmap file or a JPEG.